acids, bases, and salts. Introduction Acids taste sour, are corrosive to metals, change litmus red, and become less acidic when mixed with bases. Bases feel slippery, change litmus blue, and become less basic when mixed with acids. Acids and bases in the laboratory. Indicators are substances whose solutions change color due to changes in pH. These are called acid base indicators. Indicators are used in laboratories to show whether a solution is acidic, alkaline, or neutral by their color changes. Some common indicators are litmus, methyl orange, phenolphthalein, and Universal Indicator How do acids and bases react with metals? Acids react with metals, forming salt and hydrogen. Many acids react with reactive metals such as magnesium and zinc to form hydrogen gas and the salt of the metal. If a lighted match is held near hydrogen, it produces a pop sound. Bases do not react with metals because they are not proton donors. Reaction of carbonates and hydrogen carbonates with acids. Limestone, chalk and marble are different forms of calcium carbonate. All metal carbonates and hydrogen carbonates react with acids to give a corresponding salt, water and carbon oxide. Carbon dioxide turns lime water milky when bubbled through it. Reaction of acids with bases. Neutralization. How do acid and bases react with each other? Acids react with bases to form a salt and water. This process is called neutralization. Water is neither an acid nor a base. It is neutral. Other substances that are neutral are classified as salts. Reaction of metallic oxide with acids. Metallic oxides react with acids to give salts and water. This is similar to the reaction of a base with an acid. Metallic oxides are said to be basic oxides. Reaction of a non-metallic oxide with base. Oxides of non-metallic elements are acidic in nature. Reaction of non-metallic oxide with a base is similar to the reaction between a base and an acid. Non-metal oxides are called acid anhydrides. What do all acids and bases have in common? Some common properties of acids and bases are tabulated here. Please read on. Dissociation of an acid or a base in an aqueous solution. Acids are ionic compounds possessing a positive as well as a negative charge that break apart in water to form a hydrogen ion H positive. Bases are ionic compounds that break apart to form a negatively charged hydroxide ion OH negative in water. How strong are acid or base solutions? Strong acids are acids that are completely or nearly 100% ionized in their solutions. Complete dissociation of an acid in an aqueous solution is shown here. The common acids that are almost 100% ionized are listed here. Strong bases are completely ionized in solution. For example, KOH dissolve in water in the reaction 
KOH is equal to K positive plus OH negative. The common bases that are almost 100% ionized are listed here. Importance of pH in everyday life Plants and animals are pH sensitive. pH of the soil is important for healthy growth of plants. pH in our digestive system affects digestion. Tooth decay starts when the pH of the mouth is lower than 5.5. More about salts. A salt is any ionic compound composed of cations, positively charged ions, and anions, negative ions, so that the product is neutral, without a net charge. Salts that contain a hydroxide ion, OH negative, are basic salts, and salts that contain a hydrogen ion, H positive, are acid salts. Normal salts are those that are neither acid nor basic salts. When salts are dissolved in water, they are called electrolytes and are able to conduct electricity. Salts can be dehydrating to the human body if consumed in excess. Salts can appear to be clear and transparent, sodium chloride, opaque and even metallic and lustrous. Iron disulfide. Different salts can elicit all five basic tastes, that is, salty, sweet, sour, bitter, and savory. Family of salts. Salts having the same positive or negative radicals are said to belong to a family. For example, sodium chloride. NaCl and sodium sulfate, Na2SO4, belong to the family of sodium salts. Similarly, NaCl and potassium chloride, KCl, belong to the family of chloride salts. pH of salts A salt is formed when an acid and a base are mixed, and the acid releases H positive ions, while the base releases OH negative ions. This process is called hydrolysis. The pH of the salt depends on the strengths of the original acids and bases. Salts of a strong acid and a strong base are neutral with pH value of 7. On the other hand, salts of strong acid and weak base are acidic with pH value less than 7, and those of a strong base and weak acid are basic in nature, with pH value more than 7. Chemicals from common salt Common salt is a raw material for various materials of daily use, such as sodium hydroxide, baking soda, washing soda, bleaching soda, bleaching powder, and many more. How one substance is used for making all these different substances is shown here. Are crystals of salts really dry? Water of crystallization is the fixed number of water molecules chemically attached to each formula unit of a salt in its crystalline form. A salt with associated water of crystallization is known as a hydrate. The structures of hydrates can be quite elaborate because of the existence of hydrogen bonds. Plaster of Paris is the substance which doctors use as plaster for supporting fractured bones in the right position. Plaster of Paris is a white powder and on mixing with water, it changes to gypsum, once again giving a solid mass. Plaster of Paris is used for making toys, materials for decoration and for making surfaces smooth.